Welcome guys, I'm Panda. Today I'm going to show you what to do when you are getting stuck in a loop for a stream deck regarding the firmware update, just like what you're seeing right now. So let's follow these steps, it's very simple. You're going to search for control panel and then go to programs uh, and try to locate the stream deck and uninstall it. That way you can wipe it out completely since that one is the one that's giving you issues. And then here it's going to prompt you for um, admin confirmation. So just make sure if it's asked for a password, you do that or just click yes. And then after that, it's gone. So you will exit out of this and then go to Chrome or any browser and then look exactly for this URL um, showing you. And then pick whichever your operating system. So on window, going to install that. So clicked on it. And then I'll click on the installer I just downloaded. And then um, we are going to go through the prompt. And pretty much I'm just going to pick the drive that I wanted to be installed at. And then I wanted to create a folder just so that it's labeled pretty much. And then I'll pick the folder I created and then go the installation. Again, this is another version that's going to help me uh, bypass that loop. We will get prompted again for admin confirmation. You do that and then it will just do its thing. It's installing. All right, now that we are finished it, we are launching that. It's gonna through, go through the update, you know, normally. And then it'll ask you to install you can see already that there is no loop whatsoever um, regarding that. So just, you know, go through the prompts and then do the installation just like I'm doing. And then in no time, you're up to date once you go through the steps. So when you follow the prompts, it will pick automatically the folder that you created. Uh, and, you know, you go through the steps. Just wait for it until it's done. And you really don't have to create a folder just like I did. Uh, but I just do that because I like things organized. But yeah, you wait for it. Then you're done and it launches and voila. You no longer have that error that you had at the beginning. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. Hope this video was helpful for anybody who were having this issue. Hope you all have a good day. Bye.